Hey guys, I'm going to show you my school, uh, Penn State Baron. Last time I showed you the uh, Gannon University and uh, I suggested, I told you guys if you want you want to attend a college, you want you want to attend university or college in US, don't hesitate to send me an, a, a short message. You can drop down the comments on the uh, school interest and I'll get I'll get in touch. All right, let's go along to Penn State University. The Erie campus. Red line. Let's go. Okay guys, first we're gonna make a left, a left turn here. I wanna show you the campus where a student lives. I mean, for at least you, you. Uh, this is off, off the, off the campus. This is the. They call this place you get. I'm gonna show you the you get where student leaves these are private homes not actually private but these are apartments that they are built by the university gate the university gate this is the u gate this is the laundry university gate student center the laundry rooms are in there and the university is down there we will go there after first we need I need to show you where the student lives uh, the majority of student lives here by the UK this is these are somebody's properties yeah see there are many vehicles here for students from different states uh, those sides these are apartments
this is the end so we're gonna drive back and see go to college the college itself make a turn here All those there apartments, these are just rooms. All these buildings they are built up with only smaller, smaller rooms per student. Actually, sometimes I think for two students as well. Some buildings are two students per room. And uh, they have a little kitchen and a sitting room there. It's more like an apartment, but smaller apartments. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna go that side. It's where the university is at. But first, also, I'm gonna show you this uh, football and soccer field where they play soccer. Penn State is one of the leading. Uh, a school that in soccer and football actually in almost every game baseball football soccer around the country they are leading the country for sure this is my school here man i graduated here uh, last may of 2022 it's a very good school it's more like a whole community here. See, it's all it's built up by I-90, a Bayfront connector, which is 79, and 90 is behind it there. All right, let's go. the left again for the field that side is where the uh, library is that the library the other side there is the bursar office or the register office up there are engineering uh, classes engineering school this side here is the indoor and outdoor uh, field game field basket field uh, swimming pools and more other stuffs in there all right we're making a right turn here so this is a new project they're building i didn't get to know what it is but it is a beautiful project i'm telling you so strong the way they was building this building <laughs> That the indoor, that building there has the soccer field, they have the uh, football, basketball, uh, also the swimming, the swimming pool in there. And this side here is the soccer field. Let me see if I will get outside the car and get a, a video, an image of it. Wow, this building is so nice. It's a new one, man. Susan Her uh, Hagen call. Dude, I ne oh wow, and these students there already, man. It's so good. Let me show you the field here real quick. Probably I will get I will get to go inside. All right, guys. This is the walkway. I had to park the car <laughs> just to show you the Penn State Baron Soccer. See Penn State Baron Soccer. Soccer field. That those are the lights there, there, and this big one here. I hope the gate is open. <laughs> Well, I do know how to open this. <laughs> Boom. Woohoo. 
right there. <laughs> This this foot symbol you see here, this is Penn State's uh, logo, the Buren University logo. For the main campus, they have another finger on this side, so they have five fingers, but Buren has only four fingers. That's the difference you can tell. So this is the soccer field. You can see the post. This is soccer field at the same time is a football field. See? These are artificial grass, they are not real grass. So, which make it more beautiful, perfect, professional. Yep. This is Penn State soccer field, guys. I used to play soccer here, man, every semester. My team was always the winning team. <laughs> Yep, and down there it's an interstate, interstate, the Bayfront Connector Highway, going to I-90. Alright guys, let's head back, I'm going to show you another field, track and field actually, will be all the way back, back behind those trees there. Let's go see it. This building here for sure, it's new, and I see it's already occupied. Wow, oh, and they made it beautiful, man. Wow. So beautiful. All right. We keep going. All right, guys. I'm heading to... I'm going to show you uh, while driving the Junker Center, where actually there is basketball field. We are not getting in, but I'll pass by. I'll drive by. The Junker Center where there is football team field uh, and uh, the swimming pool. The swimming pool is actually in, in this one, in this building. And up there, there is two, uh, two basketball fields up there. Also, the karate classes, the uh, karate, taekwondo, uh, they happen there, in there. Okay, let's head down to the other side. We go back and go down this way. This way. Okay. This is how we came. So we're going back again and find another route. How oh, that dude was looking at me so strangely, man? All right, that's the other side. Actually, I forgot to tell you, this is the tennis, tennis field right there in blue. The tennis field, the library, and that the register office, that the language school, the language classes down there in the middle, and this is the police department. They are remodeling the police department. We will come back again. I will remind you the, about this. This is the parking lot for uh, the main uh, the main parking lot actually. It's not the biggest, but the visitors and everybody comes to this one here. Okay, we're going to the right side here. I'm going to show that field I was talking about. It's, it's a little bit of a walk, but I will walk. I will walk, I want to stretch up my feet too. We're gonna walk through that, that bridge there. The barren field. 
there is a lot of stuff up there but it's not gonna be too much fun so and look for those who don't live in US or those who never seen snow before look how all the trees seems to be dry no leaves this is the season they call the fall seasons only this green tree is here uh, which one these two here are the winter trees they survive those trees they never die but all the others they dry the leaves fall down and they're gonna stay there like that until at least for five to six months to start growing again green see during summertime you cannot see through these trees you cannot like look from here i can see all the way in there to where i am going because of the uh the trees are dried okay guys that one there this place there is the baseball baseball field but we are not going there either we're going this way to the bridge by the barren fields <laughs> Look at that little bridge. <laughs> Very expensive bridge. <laughs> Solid and expensive. <laughs> you want to see the water going through? There is a waterfall down there. Look. It's not a waterfall. But yeah, it, it is a fall. It comes from the hills. From the saddle. Depression. See, on this side, that looks like a little fall down there, but, well, it's just a little, like I said. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, we finished the bridge. We're going all the way down there. At the bridge. Goodbye bridge. Goodbye bridge. The London Bridge. Oh, look at the trees, man. See how all the leaves are down on the ground? You can only see all those leaves, nothing else on the ground here. This is the fall season, fall season. All the trees seems to be dried like a dead, 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 dead area. <laughs> Look at that. It's always green during summertime. Whew. Wow, it's crazy crazy out here <laughs> guys we are we are almost there that guy there running uh, he was my my soccer instructor soccer class <laughs> yeah he knows me a very very good player man my team was the everyday winner he's running track field so back there all the way down there you see this post this post here that the baseball field again another one this used to be old this is the older one it's no longer frequented 
But this here though is the track field. This is the track field. You run all the way around. All the way till here. Track field. Alright guys, like I promised, I showed you the track field. Let's head back and I'll show you something else. Let's go in schools now. Let's go in schools. I'm gonna show you by passing by. I will enter into the library if possible just to show you something. No, no, no library. I don't have parking pass. Guys, it's quiet here. Quiet. It's so quiet. All the trees are dried. It's quiet. <laughs> Shh, don't talk. Just watch. Let's get out of here and go to something else. That's uh, the building up there is the most schools there, the arts classes like music and restaurant is up there too. And the restaurant here, this is the movie theaters, the students produces. This is a science building, like math classes, the science, other science classes, biologies, chemistries, they are all in this side of the school. It's very huge, we can see it all while, while driving, but I'm gonna try my best to get in there, just for a little bit. This old building here is a science building. More parkings everywhere. Yeah, there is so many students attending this school. Online and in person. So, expect it to be overloaded with students and vehicles. Student vehicles. This is the back of that science building. Yeah, let's not go that far. We just make a U-turn here. The science building. Okay, this is one entrance here on the back. And there is another one here. There is another, a few, two more on the other side there. They have the back of the other side of the building. That's another entrance. Okay. All right, guys. I gotta meet someone here. The IT department. I'm returning the school computer since I graduated. Last time during COVID, we had to shut down uh, in person and go virtual. So I left my my laptop was my laptop broke down. So I had laptop from these guys here. Let's enter from here anyway.
is that building the physics classes are there and the chemistry classes all the way to down here all the way to down here and more other classes are on that side of there if you follow the road there's many more other classes Zan building this is Zan building science building and the other side Hammer Mill building to you by the university. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Todd? So, university lent it out this laptop and we're looking at the fit water key recovery. I don't think we don't have a tile on you. No, no. Computer no. lab. This gentleman rings a bell. You were, you borrowed this back in like in May. Guys, I'm inside. This is the buildings. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go this side. Then we're gonna come back this way. Let's go this way first. We have a blackboard. You can only, yeah, blackboard, projectors, and another blackboard, whiteboard. This is for the projector. That one for the projector. Look, this was for the exam. <laughs> I, I, I don't miss that one at all. See, it's a chemistry class with the periodic table. I didn't like this class at all. All right, let's keep going. Another class. Projector there. Whiteboard. The TVs. Let's keep going. Chemistry lab. This is where you get to mix the molar masses and other masses. Students. Oh, this was my art class here. This is the mill. Please use the other side of the door.
This is the back side. There is more schools and housings down there for students. Want to get involved? Use this flowchart as a guide. This the other side. Outside, back outside. Going down to where I came from. to the other side we need to see some something different right that was in the school actually I'm gonna try my best to show you the uh, the library at least I'll try to see if I can get in the library and get something out of there too <laughs> yep that was sand building hammer mill building and uh, Nick building so we're gonna have to get go see something else Something else in the other side. We're gonna make a turn, a right turn by the stop sign there. Right there. <laughs> See, remember that was the tennis field I said? Taking you to the restaurant first. And the bookstore. Very common. For music, Come on, up there.
coming upstairs by the restaurant. the restaurant Plantain, banana tree. And this is the bookstore. The bookstore. This is where you catch up the bus if you don't have the bus. See that building is is a brand new. This is a police building and another soccer field, indoor soccer field. So if you need school here, if you are from around, this is the uh, where there is financial aid office, the registrar office, uh, and everything you might need to know about the school is here. Up there, those are student livings. Student lives in there and in there too. Not the library. Library is right there straight and this one here is another uh, For language school for language. I Said it when I was driving again Let's go see what's it, what's in there. There is really nothing special and I took my video editing class here down here, too uh, Let's go upstairs when we come back, we'll come back from the bottom floor. See the second floor.
these are staff's office offices the English classes and others students down there to Lily Library. Library has first, second and third floor. Ground floor, first floor and second floor. So I'm gonna start with the ground floor first. next to the sec uh, the upper floor and then finally the last floor there is classes here is a study hall Study rooms. Study room. This is group study room. Second floor. 
This was the ground floor. We're gonna pass the first floor and go to the second floor. We'll come back to the first floor later. This is a conference room or student conference room or group study room. This one and that one there. Bathrooms, toilets. I like this this image here. You can see the bottom floor and the upper floor at the same time. It's so beautiful. So this side, this is a tutor class, tutor classroom. They they tutor English, math, languages, and more others. That class in here is the English class, right here. downstairs this is the second floor let's go
This is engineering. So real. back This is the radio Penn State Radio and Penn State TV. That Penn State TV in here, the radio office. Classrooms. That one there is the that is the uh, movie production class. Okay, I guess we're done down here now. We finished the library and this one. Let's get back, head back to the car. That's it. This was my very first class. All right, these are the doors I came in through and I'm exiting from them. We've seen pretty much everything we needed to see in there. quick go to the, the engineering building driving by and the engineering building labs and student livings engineering buildings is up there this was this is the library we just came from uh, that is the engineering building and this is the Catholic uh, church for the school see all that building is engineering and business this is the student living place. I'm, I'm going to drive by a little bit. All over here. The engineering building is right this one here. But uh, there is another one back there. Let's go to, to it. This is the engineering building's parking ramps. It's so good, big. Yep. building this is the technology drive advanced manufacturing innovation all right this is the other building inside is so so beautiful so we are just driving by this time I guess the time is flying too it's getting darker so good all right guys let's head back to the student living areas down this way so we go down this way first the 
person lives in these houses, these buildings. See, I used to have my Chinese friend used to live in that, those ones. He came all the way from China to study here engineering, engineering uh, classes and went back home. So these are student or residential parking lots. See, that's a new building that they just built it recently. It's also student living. This building, by the way, have names. So you see? Yep. Yes, this is it. We're probably gonna have to go down the road and see if we can make it down there. Whoa. Now we just got to make you a turn, a turn here. How lovely, guys! Let me show you. Ohio lot. So if you are from Ohio, know that there is a building here for Ohio. They name it Ohio. So that one there. So the Ohio lot. This building is actually that one there. The one that I told you it's a, it's a new one. So this is specifically for Ohio, Ohio made, named Ohio, this area here. So Ohio people, you are all welcome. California and everybody, all welcome though. Penn State is for everyone in the US and worldwide. Guys, actually this is also Ohio Hall. You see here? Beautiful. All of them are Ohio, dude. I only thought it was just this one, actually. No, this is actually Triple Hall. Yeah, just to clarify things, this is not Ohio. This is different. All right, guys, that was the last part. Please, if it's your first time, Consider to like and subscribe for more videos. You know, when you subscribe, yes, you support my channel. And also, you get to be the first person to know, I mean, to watch the new videos once I update them. Once I, have, I, sub, I, I upload them. Alright? Okay. That the, that the library again we are heading I'm heading home so guys if you are coming to Penn State this will be your main entrance here the traff by the traffic light if you are coming from Bayfront side you will make a, a right turn but if you're coming from Buffalo from I-90 you're gonna make a left turn that side is I-90 this side is Bayfront as you can see down there it says Bayfront Connector. Yes. All right, guys. Please like and subscribe. Share if possible or if needed for more videos. And if you want to attend college, Penn State Barron or Gannon University and more, let me know. I will help you. To, I will direct you from, from wherever you are in Africa, Europe, Asia, or south america and u.s i will direct you properly all right drop down the comment below if you like share and subscribe and like thank you guys and have a good one